It was a dark and stormy night. Captain, Captain, wake up! What is it? Sir, sorry to wake you, but we have a serious problem. Well, what is it? Sir, there's a ship in our sea lane, about ten nautical miles away, and it refuses to change course. What? Well, tell them. Sir, we have, but they refuse to change course. Okay, I'll tell them. Signal goes out. You are requested to change course 20 degrees starboard at once. Signal comes back. You are requested to change 20 degrees starboard at once. What? Who is this guy? Doesn't he realize I am the captain? Let him know who I am. Signal goes out. This is Captain Horatio the 25th, requesting that you change course 20 degrees starboard at once. Signal comes back. This is Carl James the 3rd, seaman, requesting you to change 20 degrees starboard at once. What? Who is this joker? Doesn't he realize we're a battleship? We could destroy him just like that. Let him know who we are. Signal goes out. This is the mighty Missouri, flagship of the Seventh Fleet, commanding you to change course 20 degrees starboard at once. Signal comes back. This is the lighthouse. My friends, I use this story for a simple reason to show how negotiations sometimes turn into a kind of tug-of-war. When you're not able to negotiate, you become a little like the lighthouse and a little like the battleship. When you decide to negotiate and get beyond the difficult challenges you're faced with against somebody else, don't consider yourself a battleship or a captain or a lighthouse. Use diplomacy. Use strategies that will get you beyond the problem and to the solution. And when you do, people will wonder how great you are because you're neither a battleship nor a lighthouse. Be the captain of negotiations. <laughs>